Hi guys, this is the second part uh, from this video series about my new <laughs> camera mounting system on my stupid uh, slanted ceiling. First I will remove this uh, profile from this uh, boom arm. By the way, this Calumet boom arm is pretty hefty. They're not playing with uh, junk, huh? So this is uh, 3 mm thick and let me tell you, I'm 100% sure this is uh, hardened on some way. Yeah, absolutely. Look at this, huh? <laughs> Beautiful. I painted this yesterday and it's already dried and cured. Don't worry, this is only my fingerprint. And this is the wood plate, which will came under, huh? really nice. And this is the second wood plate. Hmm? And this we came like this. So this is the idea. And then my industrial <laughs> mounting plate is came like this. Hmm? Now what I wanna do, I changed my mind. So I will uh, drill here a 10 millimeter hole instead of the eight millimeter. So on this way, I can drop here into the middle some really big, really heavy, hefty uh, screw and nut. Ne. Now I have a much more bigger hole on the middle. So, like this, and then a, a big one. Make sure it can rotate uh, freely. Now I will mark this four hole here. 25. Now I have to drill this up to six millimeter. Eh. This four hole here is for this really big bad boys. Huh? Now you can see. Here is how it looks like because I have here this really big, heavy 12 centimeter beam or even 20 centimeter. So this two bad boy will go into the beam. This other two just uh, into the ceiling. But my ceiling, it's a really heavy antique uh, wood construction. So uh, I think uh, these two also will hold uh, a lot of uh, weight. So now the next step is uh, to prepare the whole assembly for the clutch mechanism. For that, I have here a really nice piece of uh, stainless steel mesh. I don't know from where, <laughs> but I have from this uh, around uh, <laughs> 100 square meters, something like this. I really, I hate this. <laughs> And you know, it's just stucking always into the skizzer. Step. Nice fit. This one is came to here. The second plate is coming to here. So now all together I have here like a clutch mechanism and and this is working I'm, I'm telling you guys this is working so if i apply if i don't apply on it uh, pressure then it's uh, rotating really we can say freely but on the moment when i press even just a little bit together then it's really really hard to move and this is what i want now we need uh, uh, this uh, special spring <laughs> solution to apply this constant uh, force on this uh, clutch mechanism. Huh? This one here is 90 millimeter and the length is 300 millimeters. So I need 150. Wow, this, <laughs> this is really hard. <laughs> Absolute German. Oh my God. <laughs> Just 
üniversitesi marker. Şık, şık. Oh, just perfect. And by the way, and that's what I'm using, of course, this is this, uh, you know, with this plastic ring inside, just to make sure nothing will get loose on top of my head. <laughs> it can be really painful if this almost 20 kilogram of <laughs> steel with the camera is falling into my neck, huh? <laughs> I built this thing like a <laughs> Russian tank, eh? Настала очередь преодоления препятствия трамплин. Прыжок и выстрел. Такие препятствия сходу могут преодолевать включительная надежность и живучесть всех узлов, агрегатов и систем. Уважаемые гости, вашему вниманию представляется продукция концерна «Тракторные заводы». Все представленные машины являются плавающими. <laughs> a Manfrotto <laughs> head, eh? Almost. So let me show you the whole assembly. Huh? So this is uh, the part which is going to the ceiling. Okay, this is the clutch mechanism. I hope you can see. And this is the bottom plate, what I can rotate freely. And I think this will work absolutely perfectly because all the weight from the camera it's let's say two meter distance from here from the center so on this end this boom arm will create enormous amount of pressure if i'm not touching or i'm not holding the boom arm uh, so when i want to rotate i only have to lift a bit the camera and the boom arm and then i can rotate really freely and from the moment when i will release the boom this uh, clutch uh, <laughs> Now her names will be like a rock solid, huh? Now let's go to the studio. Sorry guys if the audio is changed, but I have to use my iPhone to record uh, my voice. Now first I have to find the center line of my beam. Somewhere here, it, it's running parallel with my window. First I will extend this boom arm, let's say and uh, 10 or 15 centimeter make sure i have enough freedom and uh, the perfect position well let's see how it's going now i have to adjust this surface to be flat so now it's 0 0.7 0 0.4 i think we are okay in uh, half a degree now I know what will be the next uh, project in my studio. We will install some serious uh, air conditioner system. Let's test it. I'm around 110 kilogram. Yeah, and I can lift up myself. I think this screw will hold the whole building together if we get <laughs> some nuclear <laughs> war. So this two screw here is just mimic. <laughs> Nothing serious. Look at this. <laughs> yep, yeah. I think it's enough. I think we are done. Huh? <laughs> uh, nice. Uh, tomorrow I will uh, rearrange uh, the lamps on this uh, rail and then I will install here some um, electric uh, connection 
for the camera and uh, maybe I will fix one long HDMI cable uh, from the camera to the workbench. So if I open this one, <laughs> really nice, really nice. Wow, this is actually very long, it's like two meter together. Hmm? Really nice. Now I will try out this uh, swing function. So I just have to lift a bit from here and uh, oh, oh, oh guys, really nice. I can reposition my camera to here. <laughs> oh, 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 guys, I can fix this to here. No problem at all. <laughs> guys, this is just perfect. I can fix it with lights, external monitors, even other camera and other boom arm or whatever because this is really, this is really hefty. Look at this, what I can do with this <laughs> crazy setup, huh? It was a good project, no? Oh my goodness, guys, <laughs> this is absolutely luxury. <laughs> I can imagine what kind of crazy shots I can do. <laughs> with this unbelievable let me show you the full setup Xeon Crane 2 <laughs> with the Sony PXW70 camera huh? some ball joint then this really nice uh, boom arm from Calumet and my solution on a ceiling huh? really crazy so let me adjust now the camera position with hand because this is a really nice feature from uh, the Zoom Crane 2. In lock mode, you can freely adjust the camera with the hand and then the Zoom Crane will keep uh, the angle. Maybe I will drop there some linear actuator, huh? <laughs> and over there some motor to rotate this plate. Hmm, but what I will do here in a studio area, huh? I have some crazy idea, <laughs> don't worry, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed, see you next time, bye! Hi guys, this is the second, oh, the train is coming, as always. Good. No other train. <laughs> unbelievable. <sighs> Let's move forward. Ah, and I already, and I did, uh, Okay, compressor just started again. Let me switch off this compressor. So this is the holes where this really big bad, bad schnitt. This four hole is for this really big 